What's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, Dad and I are going to be going to an old home site. This house probably existed back in the early 1900s. I already know kind of what we find and uh, we actually get onto some pretty cool stuff. Dad and I both find silvers, however, there's a plot twist for my silver. If I find one, which I do, I gotta attempt a front flip and land it. And uh, haven't done a front flip in about five years. So yeah, you do the math. Enjoy this little intro guys, and let's get right to digging. Back here, I was here a couple weeks ago. Didn't really find much. Beautiful scenery, as you've probably seen on the drone footage. But I found my first find here that was halfway decent. It almost looks like a guitar pick, but I don't think guitar picks would be made of metal. Does anybody know that plays a guitar, maybe? Um, not real sure. If, it, if I can get it cleaned up and find something interesting on it, We'll show it to you as a close-up. If not, I don't know. Maybe a good tower pick. Down in the hole, I had a really good screaming signal on the simplex. I'm running that a little bit different today. Uh, I was reading online that you want to run a little bit of metal. You know how you can discriminate ironite. So I got it up on two, and I'm actually hearing a lot more grunts in what I was digging a lot of high signals, but they would be old caps and stuff like that. But, it seems like, you know, you can hear that little bit of iron, you can hear that grunt of the iron, it's really helping. But anyways, 91, 92 on the simplex, I went a 90 degree turn, it was still at 88, 89. It was about four inches deep. And I think, right here, maybe, I'm hoping the edge of a silver coin. Maybe a silver dime. We're gonna find out together. I'm almost positive it's going to be silver. Looks like it's going to be a Merc. But it is... Got some... Yeah, you can start seeing her bust there a little bit. She's facing, I think, this way. Her hair is flowing back that way. I dug my silver Mercury Dime right there. I ain't going to lie. I've seen this in the hole i don't know if you can see that shiny or not i thought sure i had another silver coin but h for honda maybe i don't know don't know what it is some kind of cap that went on to something husqvarna i don't know she's shiny all right guys so dad just found his silver dime i came back up Ran to my detector, you know, gave me a boost of confidence. You know, there's actually old coins here. That's what's up. That's what we're looking for. Grabbed my detector, swung it like three times. Dude, got a slamming hit. Not even going to lie to you guys. I mean, it's one that you can't pass up. It's uh, reading like eight inches deep and uh, got down to it, man. And it's it's, uh, it's a wall plug. It's it's a wall plug, eight, eight inches deep. I... I don't know. I, I'm disappointed. I really am. How's a wall plug eight inches deep in the ground? Hey, you guys want to see a close up of it? Here, here. Look at that. Look at that beauty. That's one of the best looking wall plugs you'll ever see in your life, guys. Wow. Amazing. Guys, I, I just don't get it. I do not get it whatsoever. It's, it's really starting to just, I, I think it's like a me thing. At this point, I really do. I I don't even know where to start, honestly. I really don't. Is that a drone coming in or something? Sorry, heard a weird noise. Um, slamming ahead, twenty, you know, five inches down in the ground. 
I see a glimpse of it. I mean, perfect condition. I mean, beautiful. If it was a girl on a scale of one to ten, she'd find ten. I mean, straight up. You know, you're trying to like take a second glance at her as she walking by. So she, whenever she's not looking, hurry up, give her a little eyeball peek. Like, oh shoot! Check this out right here. Come on in here. See what we got. Look at this. Oh man, she's a beauty. That's silver. Freaking silver. What the heck? Yep. Not silver, just really shiny. Five inches down in the ground. Hey, what's up there, Mr. Roosevelt? Guys, I, I I'm I'm I wanna go ahead and just apologize. I I don't even know what happened. You know, I'm here trying to just be stupid. And I tried to pull a prank on dad, letting him know that, oh yeah, I found silver. Well, that whole last clip where I, you know, was pretty much humdrum down in the dumps, turned out actually it's silver. I thought if you seen Roosevelt or whoever this is, I guess it's Rosie, I don't know, sorry. Um, and it's younger than like 64, I guess it's silver. Dude, it, this is silver. What the heck? <laughs> um. <laughs> Hold on, let's take a closer look at this. Check this old boy out. Let's get a close-up up in here. I don't know who does the close-up around here, but go ahead and start it. So I made a deal with myself. Probably not one of the smartest things I've done. I said, if I find silver with this new setup I'm rocking with the, what am I rocking, the Equinox? Yeah, that's what I'm using, the Equinox 600. I'll attempt the front flip. I don't care. I'll send it. What's the worst that can happen? Break a leg? Let's try this front flip, man. Let me get a practice roll real quick. Okay. That's all the worst that's gonna hurt. That's yeah, not right. too bad. Commit to it, though. confidence was there though I don't know if I can move my neck <laughs> all right end it it wasn't gonna hurt that bad all right guys I found my silver about three steps that way I'm not gonna look because my neck's a little stiff um, but as you can see this is a pretty good signal for the Equinox 600 it's about the same depth as the silver and uh, I'm kind of hoping it's not. I mean, or if it is, I'm not going to try to do another front flip. So let's dig it up and see what we got. Well, guys, it's not silver. I'm actually not sure what it is, but here you go. It's uh. It appears to be some trash, but it was coming up a good signal. Oh well. Hey guys, we've had quite a few questions about the shovels we use. Um, if you haven't checked out our Facebook page, we get onto some decent discussions there and a lot of uh, finds that people find on there. So if you haven't checked our Aqualand Relics Facebook group out, all you gotta do is search it, Facebook group, Aqualand Relics. But anyways, these two shovels. I use the smaller version. I'm like five foot eight, and Jordan's a smidgen over six foot. So you can see his is probably about four inches longer than mine. The only thing I don't like about Jordan's, Jordan's weighs almost two and a half pounds more than mine. You can see by how big his blade is of his shovel. His weighs close to four pounds, my, or his is close to five pounds, where mine's only close to two and a half pounds. Big difference. Only thing I wish I had was the rounded thing. I, I really like that aspect of his shovel, but I like my aspect because it's light. And trust me, <clears throat> when you're carrying a shovel three, four, five hours in a day, five pounds to two and a half pounds makes a big, big difference. So if you have any more questions, feel free to ask. We try to answer any questions you give us. Here's an old home site that sits right up here on this little hill ridge right here. I'm down below it. 
got something. I don't know exactly what it is. I didn't want to pull it out of the hole first. But it's really green. It's got some real green patina. And it's bigger than a penny. Point it out. Right here. Down at the end of my finger. Let's dig it out here. Oh my. It's got some age to it, whatever it is. I don't know if it's a coin. She's green, but she's smooth though. Wow. Look how thin that is. Maybe a button? No, it's not a button. It don't have no shank. Well, it might be a shank there, maybe, possibly. If it is, it's all center. Maybe we can get a better look at it when we get more light. It's starting to get dark on us and it's starting to rain but man that could be a good find right here all right guys so pretty much as soon as i stepped out of the car i came across a couple signals this was like my second signal and uh i apologize for it being dark out it we're actually running out of daylight here but luckily i know the guy that edits these videos and uh, he said he can change the video to make it look a little better so that's going to happen right about now i don't know if it looks any better or not but you should be able to see a little bit more clear Right here is going to be my find. I think it's going to be an old button. I, I actually don't even know if it's old. It just looks like a flat button. Came up a solid 23, guys. It's uh, pretty nice, honestly. I mean, my only find of the day so far. I only had about an hour and a half to hunt. So, But on to the next find.